welcome back to my channel. My name is Michelle. I'm a full-time reseller on Poshmark and eBay. My username is mcware for you if you're interested in checking out any of my things. This is a full week and a half worth of inventory that I had I've thrifted in the past week and a half. So I'm just gonna, it's a shoes, bags, no, shoes, hat, bras, linens, and a whole bunch of clothes. So let's just hop right into it. The first thing I picked up with this cute little rose hat, solid white, and it is by the brand Imperial. And I have not decided whether I'm going to keep it or not. So hats, or hats sell sometimes if they are branded, but just a cute little hat like this, I picked it up for a dollar. If I was gonna sell it, I would get 10. So I may just keep it. All right, next we have the bras, of course. What's a haul without some bras? Here's a neon yellow one with black trim. It's really, really well made, sports bra, really cool. And it is by the brand Soma Sport 42 Double D. And these brands, uh, Soma is a very, it's more popular than Victoria's Secret. And I'm gonna say it's probably the same price point. Retails for about 68 and I could sell it between 20 and $25. So, bread and butter. Next is a Cacique soft cut bra, gray and black. And it is a size 40C, more of a smaller size. All right. I, there's only about five different brands of bras that I pick up. And Cacique, Soma, Victoria's Secret, um, FYI, Victoria's Secret pink does not do good at all, but just plain Victoria's Secret does. So this is a Cassie bra, and it is a size 40H, and it's one of those convertible bras that you could take the straps off and wear it strapless, and it does have underwire, very supportive. That's it for bras. Next is a pair of Cole Haan shoes. Really, really cool. I'm not sure if they are vintage or not. Um, loafers, and they are a size nine. They're size nine. Can we see that size nine? Yes, we can. Oh, let's see. Oh yeah, and it's like a braided leather, very extremely well made, but also flexible. Definitely retailed for over a hundred, and I will probably sell them for about 60. I pay $5.99 for each pair of shoes. I pay $3 per bra and $4.99 for skirts, pants, and denim. Dresses are also $5.99. So basically everything is $4.99 at our North Carolina Goodwill except for the dresses that are $5.99, blazers that are $6.99, men's suits that are $9.99, just in case you were wondering. These are like new, and these are by the brand Land's End. I always pick up Land's End. Very sporty slash preppy, and they are like new. Maybe worn once or twice. And they are a size, oh, let's see, eight, eight B. Yeah, 8B, and that's what they look like. All right, next I have some placemats, and I just brought these for myself because I love this like tapestry type of deal, and they are just Harvest, Harvest placemats, and these are were 50 cents each, and I brought six of them. And they are for myself, solid blue, vintage, maybe 90s. All right, got a big pile here. Next is a pair of Banana Republic Harper Pants in the size eight. These are just bread and butter, but they do sell. Should get about $30 for them. Just some basic black straight leg trousers in a size eight. All right. We have some more pants and these are gorgeous. Look at those sailor pants. And they are Ralph Lauren and also size eight. So well made, probably retail for about 120. Wide leg, full sailor. The buttons are really, really nice. All right. Next we have a Romans plus size 22 women, which W wide actually, not women. I mean, it is a women's, but 22 W uh, is wide. So it's just a fuller, looser cut where if it just said 22, it's a standard plus size. But if you see the W, um, it's just a more fuller cut. So it's probably about two inches 
larger in size, if that makes sense. But the pattern was just too pretty. Again, bread and butter. This will probably only sell for $20, $25. I spent $4.99. All right. Next is a piece, Juicy Couture. And they do sell Juicy Couture at Marshalls now. This is new. Yeah, new with tags. And it says Juicy on the bottom of the leg. Uh, very, very soft velvet. It doesn't say Juicy on the rear. It says it at the bottom of the leg. And somewhere in this big pile of clothes, I have the matching top. Um, I brought the top and then like half of a week later, the pants were put out. So yes, Juicy Couture plus size 2X. And those are the bottoms. Next, I have some linen striped new with tags, as you could see. And these are size 18 wide Talbots, retail for $99, which is pretty crazy. And they are just a linen button with a drawstring and a zip. Packets in the back for your cell phone. Blue and white straight leg trousers. Linen, great. They would look great with a little white tee. Next, I have a Chico's size 2. Chico's uses vanity sizing. Their size 2 is a size large. Size 3 is an extra large. Size 1 is a medium. And it's just a little cardigan, a little cotton cardigan. Beige and tan in color. Really nice. All right, the best find of the full week was this jo Johnny Was plus size tunic. Retails for $348 on their website currently. So I will probably list this for half of the retail. It's linen, tons and tons of embroidery, so gorgeous. That's what the Johnny Was tag looks like always. If you see it, doesn't matter the size, although plus size does sell for more, but um, you definitely want to pick it up. It's Johnny Was in pink letters up there and then like all that embroidered right on the tag. So yes, Johnny Was, you definitely want to pick up. And again, I got this for $4.99. All right, next is another new with tags, Chico's, size three, which is XL, retails for 79, and it's a lightweight, light green color, tap sleeves, feels like cotton. Uh, let's see if it is cotton. These are great for the summertime, and it is uh, Raimi and cotton, 44% cotton, 35% Raimi, or 30, 46, something like that. And that's what that looks like. It'll look really nice in dark denim or white jeans. Another new with tags. Look at that, $128. I wonder if it belonged to the same person. Size three, which is their XL. So this is a button up, a Cardi, and it has some metallic woven through. Feels very substantial. It also feels very stretchy. And it is their gold Surrey three-quarter like sleeve cardigan in a size three, retailed for $128. But even so, I will probably list it for $50. And maybe I'll sell it for $50 or I will take an offer. Yes. All right. Next is a little J. Crew swimsuit. J. Crew makes very pretty um swimsuits and they're, I don't know if you could hear that, the quality of them is just really substantial and it's not that cheap, stretchy um, spandex. It's lined and it feels like it has cotton in it and it's J. Crew size eight and it is has a underwire built-in bra and you could wear it tied around the neck like a halter or strap it and tie it at the sleeves. Okay, full bottom on the back. Size eight, very stretchy. So that was a good find. Next was a Lily Pulitzer, vintage. This is the Lily Pulitzer tag that is vintage, pre-1994. And then after, if it's um, the ones that are not vintage, is a pink tag. The newer tag is actually as well, pink. So they do have two pink tags out, but this is the pre-90s. So it has little koala bears, sunshines, lime green, yellow, starfishes, lemons, limes, really cute. I wish it was a larger size, but it is only a size small. And look at that, the Goodwill made a mistake and put a size medium. So just a button up, very preppy and cute. You would pair this with white, white linen pants would look nice or white denim. All right, next we have Umji, size 2X. I picked this up because it was new with tags. 
and it is just a plum tunic and kind of boho-ish maybe short sleeves yes has some fringe so definitely boho a really a nice plum color and it's a 2x and quite long so it'll cover the bum and i would just wear this over some black leggings all right next is i rarely find plus size women size 6x but this is a plus size 6x nighty and usually when i find these they're about a 1x and I don't usually pick up really small sizes. Um, I got this for $4.99. And it is by the brand Only Necessities, which is an online catalog. I think they own Women Within. And it's just a navy blue, looks new, feels new, and it's just a nightgown, house dress. All right. Next, I have a new with tag Stenum Vintage Cherokee Jacket, which I like myself. Oh no, it's not Cherokee. Hunter's Run. They had a Cherokee one and I picked this one. Only allowed myself to pick up one. New with tags, Hunter's Run, size 2X. 100% cotton, never worn. Definitely, um, probably 90s. Because nowadays, to cut costs, they don't use 100% cotton on denim jackets. Usually they put some spandex in there since it's cheaper. Or polyester. But this one is 100% cotton. And I already said, it is a size 2X. New with tags. All right, next is a two-piece nighty, and I picked it up even though it was a smaller size, and when I, when I say smaller size, I mean just a size large. Very Brady Bunch, and it has the little tiny little, maybe right above the knee, unless you're, this would be right above the knee if you are 5'5 five, five or 5'6. Five, if you're taller, it probably wouldn't work. So, this is the little robe. And it is by the vintage brand, which I, I think you could still purchase them, but not these vintage ones. This is by Shadow Line, which was very popular in the 50s and 60s. And it's a size large, 100% nylon. And try to see if it says made in the USA. I, would, I suspect it would be made in the USA, the vintage pieces. Look at that. So cute. So pretty. So this is the little robe. And it goes over the little nighty. Two piece set, which I paid $4.99. All right, what are you? This is, okay, Bowden. This is the new Bowden tag. If you find a newer piece, the newer pieces sell. The older pieces do not sell, for me anyways. This is the newer one. The font is really nice, bold black. And it is a, a U.S. size 12, U.K. size 16. So it is a size 12, and I think it's a faux wrap. Yes, it is. And it has a slit, not lined, and it has a full slit right there. So this would be great if you are going on a cruise, date night, vacation, throw over a swimsuit with that big slit. Very, very pretty. Really nice fabric. All right, now I have a men's blazer, which I absolutely love. The quality of this, when I was going through the blazers, I just felt the quality and knew it had to have been something. And it is a In Search, which I, most people are not well familiar with this brand, um, but the brand actually sells really good. I've sold two of their linen, um, linen men's shirts uh, in the past six months, and I sold them for 50, so I'm gonna put this up probably for 75. It's just polyester nylon. And I'm looking for the size, which I'm not seeing the size yet, but that I just wanted to show you the tag of what it looks like. Lots of times on blazers, if you don't see the size, the size is hidden usually in the um, pockets, generally speaking. So they tagged it a size large, but I will have to have measurements and look in all the pockets, which I will do at a later date because I don't want to bore you. All right, so now we have some more shoes. These are size 11. I thought they were Minnetonka's at first, but they're actually Comfort View, which is a same tier as Minnetonka's, but not as well known. Comfort, Comfort View, and they are size 11. They are real suede. Um, boho, these would look really nice with a maxi dress. Zip up the back. All right, another pair, which need to defuzzify. And these are Acorn Men's Slippers, which I've sold only once before. They are all wool, like, um, what's the brand that's all wool? Allbirds. 
and um, acorn. See the little acorn inside? And do they say? Yeah, and they also say acorn. Men's size 12, 13. And they look. I mean, they look new inside. There's no footprints or anything. Everything looks nice. And then it's just like a fuzzy wool. So maybe they don't need defuzzifying. I think that is actually the look. So if you are a size 12, 13 in men's slippers, wool slippers. All right, now I have a pair of Drew gold leather metallic sparkly work shoes. Slip resistant, so they're just really blingish and pretty. And they are, I'm seeing a tag there. A tag that does not belong in there that says size 42. I don't think this is the right, no. That's not the right tag. I'm not sure why that was in there. They are a size, here we go. They're a size Tuscany. That's the, um, the name of them. And they are 10 and a half wide. Size 10 and a half women's wide. Oh, new with tags. Guess that's why I picked them up. Yeah, new with tags. Golden sneakers. Are they flexible? A little bit flexible. All right, getting down there. Another bra, Cassique, new with tags, as you could see. And let's see, she's a big girl, look at that. And it is a size 42J, 42J. J, Ks, and Ms do quite well for me. There we go, and it's Cassique, and must have brought, oh no, retails for $42.95, so not too bad. Probably sell it for $25, I paid $3. Some more Easter grass, 50 cents, and I like to use this, this specific thicker kind to um, put in the, the jewelry bags that I sell. All right, next is a bodysuit, and it, it's a thong bodysuit, and it's by White House Black Market. It did come from TJ Maxx, but that shouldn't matter. And it is a size large, US large, House of Harlow. Not White House Black Market, is that what I said? Sorry. I always get White House Black Market and House of Harlow mixed up, but um, they feel like skims. I have some skims ones and they feel like the skims. They're super stretchy, snatches in the waist, but it does have a thong in the back and it is new with tags, so we don't have to worry about that. And I picked it up for $4.99, I will list it for $35. All right, moving right along, some swimsuit action here. Beautiful red swimsuit, gosh, it's so beautiful. And it is new with tags cutouts in the back and in the front and it's padded bust but it does have the removable pads if you want to take those out and it is new with tags from Nordstrom and it is blue rod blue blue rod that's the brand blue rod and uh, retails for $98 so I'll probably put it up for 50 okay and down to the last few things. Here's another blazer. Again, it feels so soft. And when I felt it, I knew there was cashmere in it. And there is. And it's a men's blue blazer. And let's see. Oscar de la Renta is the brand. So it is a very good brand. I'm looking for, oh, and there we go. Size 48R, 48R. And it is wool, cashmere, and nylon. Wool, cashmere, and nylon and it's a size 48. 48 must be a popular brand because when I find men's blazers, nine out of 10 times there are, they're um, size 48. And it would be 48 chest for a man. Okay, last few things. All right, Lauren Ralph Lauren 1X, 100% cotton, red button-up career blouse. All right, these are my bread and butter and these are kind of like 20, $25, this is what pays the bills, bread and butter stuff. So that. Next, I have a little vintage Wilson's Y2K mini skirt, Wilson's leather, leather, and this is a size four. So cute, size four, and you wear it over leggings, over fishnets, lace, or just over over a swimsuit. Actually, as long as the swimsuit's dry, that would also look cute. And then you would use your swimsuit if you have your favorite one-piece swimsuit as a bodysuit with this. That would look cute. Any 80s party, 90s, goth, anything like that. This would be great. It is a nice, soft, genuine leather, and it is lined, size 4. And lastly, what do you know? 
the top piece of the Juicy Couture, size 2X, new with tags, and it just says Juicy, super, super soft. Oh my goodness. So either a little sports set. It's probably um, pajamas, maybe, but work out at the gym. That was a nice, cool day. It would look adorable. And yes, here we go. Retails for $58. And I do have the matching set. Um, each piece I paid $4.99 for. So $10 invested. Okay, if you're still with me, 20 minutes later, thank you so much. And uh, if, again, if you're interested in anything, I, uh, you could find all of these things will be listed in my Poshmark and eBay uh, closet at MC Wear for You. Thank you for watching and have a nice day. Bye-bye.